Viking at 11, a massive wildfire forces evacuations and tracing. We're tracking the windy conditions, making the firefight tough. Also, it's not something you want to see in your backyard. It's a mountain lion that has neighbors on high alert. Next at 11. Right now at 11, the biggest wildfire California has seen in months. The evacuations ordered near the Bay Area. After winds whip up a massive blaze, we are tracking the conditions, making that fire fight tough. And caught on camera, a mountain lion roaming San Jose. Longtime residents are saying they never have seen a big cat this close to downtown. Plus, a big boost for San Francisco, a surprise rave drawing thousands in the city as it looks to rebound. Slowing down a massive wildfire burning between Livermore and Tracy continues to grow. It's been dubbed the Corral Fire. The flames broke out around 2.30 this afternoon near a Lawrence Livermore Lab test site about 20 miles from Tracy. It has now grown to more than 10,000 acres, more than doubling in size in just the last several hours. We know at least two firefighters have been hurt, with one of them flown to a hospital in San Jose. No word on how they're doing right now. The fire started east of the Livermore National Laboratory, but strong winds have pushed it towards Tracy. It has already jumped 580 at several spots, we're told, inching closer to the Tracy Hills community on the southern side of the city. Evacuations are underway right now as well. This map right here showing the evacuation zone. People living along 580 as well as those in the Tracy Hills community. Anyone near the California Aqueduct has also been told to leave and people living south of Tracy Boulevard should be ready to go. Now we got some new video from a viewer showing the fire from above. The man says he shot this while flying to SFO earlier tonight. Gives you a full view of the sheer size of this fire. 580 is shut down from Highway 205 to Interstate 5. You can see why this video posted on Snapchat earlier showed what some drivers had to deal with. You can see this driver trying to get through that smoke, but it's next to impossible at times. But joining us now, Battalion Chief Josh Silveria with Cal Fire. And uh, well, first of all, thank you very much for being here. Let's talk about those two firefighters. Uh, two firefighters injured. How are they doing, and how's everyone else doing? Any other injuries that you know of? The firefighters are doing good. Uh, they are treated um, at scene, and the determination was made to get them to local hospitals. Uh, their, their injuries are being uh, classified as uh, minor to moderate, uh, but given that uh, we do have such a good facility uh, in San Jose, uh, that one firefighter,